deadliest amoebas in the world. Meglaria fowleri, also known as the brain-eating amoeba, eats away at brain tissue, causing almost immediate death. Once this amoeba enters your nose, it races up to your brain where it begins a terrifying feast. But what's truly chilling about Meglaria fowleri isn't just how it invades, but the rapid onslaught of horror that follows. Things turn bad when people dive or swim in water contaminated with the amoeba, be it a lake, a hot spring, or poorly maintained pool, and the water splashes high up their noses. When Neglaria fowleri enters the human nose, it starts by devouring brain cells, bypassing the body's natural defenses as it makes its way towards the brain. The symptoms begin pretty vaguely. A headache, fever, nausea, and vomiting. This amoeba doesn't just infect your brain, it devours it, leading to hallucinations, seizures, and an inability to function. The horror peaks as infected individuals descend into confusion and terror, their systems shutting down until the brain swells too much to sustain life. Up to 97% of patients infected by the amoeba share this fate. In almost most cases, by the time an infection by Neglaria fowleri is wrecked, the disastrous battle for the brain is already so far along that there is almost nothing to be done. There's no cure once symptoms appear, making early detection and prevention the only defense against this silent aquatic killer. So how how worried do you need to be about this horrifying killer amoeba? Well, not very. While Neglaria fowleri is extremely deadly, the overall risk of infection is relatively low. In the last decade, there have been a few hundred cases. You are way more likely to drown in a pool than to get infected. Not only does the amoeba need to be flushed high up your nose, it also needs to get a good grip, and it also has to make its way through the first lines of defense.